Friends, it's Rachel with the Ponds Farmhouse, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make a little simple work apron. This would be perfect for crafting or for gardening, whatever you need, where you can have little pockets at hand to uh, hold all your supplies. We're actually going to be using this little tea towel that has a little red stripe on it. And, I'm, and since it has a red stripe, I'm gonna actually use some little ticking fabric to accent it with. So let's get started and let me show you how quick and easy it is to make this little fun apron. Okay, the very first thing we're gonna do is go ahead and just fold over our uh, tea towel. And I am going to see that it's about 13 inches. I, that's the length that I determined I wanted my apron to be, 13 inches. So we wanna use um, a pin to hold this in place so that um, we don't lose the size of it. So we're just gonna put about three in here and that should hold it. The next thing we wanna do is go ahead and measure out our um, ticking fabric. And again, what I'm doing here is about a 14 inch wide by about 10 inches deep. And then we're just gonna, you know, cut this off right about here. And, um, and then we're gonna take it over to the sewing machine and we're gonna finish off the edges of this. So that's gonna be the first uh, step that we do here. Okay, now that we have our little pocket that we're gonna put on the front of this, we're gonna turn this over and we are going to place this dead center. So we wanna make sure we're in the very center of our piece, which is right here, right where the pin is. So we know that's the very center. And then the center of this piece is right here. So we wanna put it right in the dead center. And I'm gonna line it up um, here at the bottom with the um, the trim piece, the, the little uh, red stripe on it so that it still shows. So pull that up just a little bit so we can still see the red. All right, and then we're gonna just take this and pin it to the tea towel. And then after we get it pinned on, what we're gonna do is we're gonna carry it back over to the sewing machine and we're gonna stitch this around these three sides. We're not gonna stitch it across the top because that is where we want um, to, to have the pocket available. So we get one more in here and then we're gonna go back over to the sewing machine. So now we have our pocket on the front of our apron and now we wanna make our um, ties. So what I have is another strip of, um, actually two strips of the ticking fabric and a half inches wide. But what we're gonna do is we're gonna combine these together to make a tie. So what I'm going to do first is we're gonna sew this in together so we're gonna put a pin on both ends and we're gonna sew those, um, those ends together. And then we're gonna turn this and we're gonna turn these under and sew them. So let's take a look at how that goes. Okay, now we, that we have our uh, ties made, what we wanna do is take the 
um, the back side of our um, apron and we're gonna fold in about four inches here and then fold it back again so that you basically have about a two inch little um, pleat here. And once you have that pleat in place, what we're gonna do is we're gonna take the um, tie that we just made and we're gonna stick it right in there and we'll put a pin in there to hold it secure. And then what we wanna do is we wanna stitch it down. So what I'm gonna do first, let's get that even, is I'm gonna stitch it down this way first. along the edge so it's completely secure. Kind of do that twice because we want that, to, this is what's gonna hold it on your body so you want it to be done right. And then we're going to take the pin out and we're gonna come right across the top here with another stitch. And then you want it to be real secure. So now our tie is securely in place and we're gonna do the other side and then I'll show you how cute this is. Hey friends, we have a cute little apron that is gonna be perfect for tucking your scissors into, your pencils, your gardening tools, whatever you would like for it to be. Plus it's super cute. I'm actually gonna demonstrate it for you. This outfit that I've got on is not the perfect one to have on because it's got this little pocket thing in the front. But as you can see, you just wrap this around, bring your ties around to the front and tie your little cute apron on. The only thing that was difficult about doing this particular uh, project was making the ties themselves. And if that's not something that you're comfortable with, uh, by all means, just go out and buy you some, some ribbon. Uh, uh, just make sure you get the right length and um, this would work perfectly. I just didn't have any. Plus I decided I wanted to use the contrasting uh, fabric on this, but see how cute this is. And, and again, you know, you can just tuck your uh, tools in here and you've got them right at hand when you're out gardening or doing your crafts. So I hope you enjoyed that. And uh, if you have any questions, be sure and ask me. I wanted to come back on because one thing that I think I'm going to do um, is I'm going to come back in and run a stitch right up the middle because this is a pretty big pocket. And I'm feeling like if you put a lot of things in it, it's probably going to start to sag. So I'm going to run a stitch exactly right, just one single stitch right at the very center here, just to make it a little bit more secure. And then you've actually got two pockets instead of just the one. And I feel like it'll be a little bit more secure. So I just wanted to come back on and share that little bit tip with you. Uh, and y'all enjoy and I hope you have fun making your um, little aprons.